In this lecture, we will see a scenario of how to fix inaccessible due to its protection level. And we will be fixing a particular scenario of accessibility issue with a C sharp method. So, let's flip over to Visual Studio now. So, here is a program, here is a C sharp console application, and this is the main entry point. And here you can see there is a red squiggly line which says if you mouse over it that swapper dot swap with the uh, this is a generic type of method with it accepts two arguments of reference type ref a and ref t ref b there it is not in it is inaccessible or not accessible due to its protection level okay so. If you run this application, here it is also coming. So it is without running this application, you can see that there is a compile error. So if you look into uh, the bottom, this um, output window, you can see there is one error. It is the same thing, it is inaccessible due to its protection level. Now let's visit the swap method. So go to the definition. So this is the swap definition is on a swapper class that I have written. Basically, this program was to swap. Two variables, okay, of type t, which could be anything like integer, boolean, or any uh, particular type. So this was the logic. Logic is simple. Now, can you point out the spot out the problem? How I can fix this? So what happens is that when in the program class, it is trying to access this swap, and I have declared this method as a static method. So that's fine. You don't need to instantiate. An instance of the swapper class, you can straight away call it, but here is the catch. You need to write it as public. Okay, let's write public and see. So, even before writing the public and fixing it, let's run this application also. Okay, once. So, no, here you can see the issue is still there. Swapper.swap on t, t is a generic t type, ref t ref t is inaccessible due to its protection level. Now, let's fix this issue by writing the public accessibility modifier and then running this application. And then it fixes the issue and gets you the right output with a equals 10 and b equals 5. That's what is intended for because, you know, a was previously 5. Now it has swapped to, it has swapped the value of b and b has swapped the value of a so you can see that you know you can uh, easily make a mistake like that inadvertently or sometime without knowing also the correct reason uh, you can um, fix it up 